hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel i'm excited today because i've got something for my university students this is a budget friendly egg stew with rice which i'm going to teach you guys today right here on my channel okay you see those days are you're just tired to cook but you have to eat this is the recipe that you need to make now all you need is four tomatoes and two onions very straightforward if you want to double this up just go with this measurement so you can make eight tomatoes and four onions now adding some salt to wash your tomatoes and onions well one thing about me is i like very very clean stuff when i'm cooking your food needs to be healthy and clean okay now i'm going to chop these onions and tomatoes up just like this okay you can go ahead and blend this but when you blend it just know you're going to take a long time before this you cook up because there is no bell pepper no carrots to help the tomatoes cook faster this is just raw tomatoes and raw tomatoes can really stress you out so that's why i'm adapting this method of chopping everything okay now you can see i took out the seeds of the tomatoes out because i don't want the stew to cook fast the seeds will tend to make it cook slow and i don't want that for you guys okay so i'm just going to go ahead and chop the tomatoes and the onions up just like this okay now the next thing i'm going to do is beat up five eggs you can use four you can use three eggs the quantity depends on you if you're making eggs stew and you want the eggs to be a lot in it so five eggs is standard for this one now going to go ahead and cook your rice add in your water add in some onions just for flavor some oil to make the rice cook well and then you're going to go ahead and add in some sauce to taste okay now i'm going to go ahead and add in your washed rice to this i'm using about three to four cups of rice here and i'm going to cover this up and let it cook okay now go ahead and make your stew add in some oil to your saucepan add in that chopped onions and just fry this for a few minutes okay now i'm going to go ahead and add in some powdered pepper pepper and some ginger powder here just to make the stew a little bit spicy okay now you can go ahead and blend those peppers or when you blend the peppers it loses its <laughs> low budget uh, vibe do you see so you're just going to go ahead with this method now add in the chopped tomatoes and just give this a good mix and you're going to add in some water to cook that's it that's a recipe very straightforward and very simple now at this point you just want the stew to cook well so that it won't have that because mm, so uh -huh. when you're making stew like this you know you're going to face this problem so just make sure the stew cooks very well but with this method it will not stress you so much okay now i'm going to go ahead and add in some seasoning cube i'm using half of that seasoning cube that you saw there you can use more than half but don't take the full one because it will make it salty a bit now add in that eggs that you were whisking earlier okay and cover this and let that egg scramble in the stew don't stir it immediately after you pour the eggs inside no it has to fry a bit before you stir it up okay when you're stirring it please make sure you stir it gently because you don't want to fully scramble all those eggs inside okay now just go with this method and your egg stew is ready very simple very fast now go ahead and cover your stew and let it fully cook well and your egg stew and rice is ready okay very simple recipe this one when you're going to class you can make it fast 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 or maybe when someone comes to your room and you want to surprise a person with some fast you you know that this recipe is the best option now i'm going to go ahead and add in some onions just for garnishing and check on your rice if the rice is ready you can go ahead and save now this stew goes well with yam as well and it goes well with spaghetti too so you can pair this with your spaghetti or you can pair this with your yam spaghetti if you don't want to waste too much money on rice okay now go ahead and serve this up and enjoy yourself guys i know you guys will like this recipe i know lots of people will try it too and you know what i realized these low budget recipes are really really nice like you know you're not doing too much you're just going straight to the point and actually i like it now i'm going to pair this with my molly's irish cream if you've not heard about molly's irish cream this is the newest irish cream here in ghana and it is so creamy and so fresh and nice guys it has a little bit of alcohol in it so it's up to you if you want to try it or not okay all i know is you're going to love it will you try this recipe don't forget to like and subscribe bye